Hi, this is a book trailer on Captain's Courageous by Rita Kipling. This book takes place in the Victorian era, and it follows the story of a boy named Harvey, who was a very spoiled 15-year-old kid who was the son of an American multimillionaire. He accidentally falls off, off of an ocean liner heading towards Europe, and he's picked up by a fishing boat called We're Here. Um, he has to stay on the boat for several months and earn his keep until he can go home. The important characters that we should know is Harvey, who's the main character. Captain Disco is a captain of the We're Here. And Dan, who is Harvey's best friend. The connection to the Victorian era in which this book takes place is a strong emphasis in utilitarianism, which in shortest terms possible means what will bring the greatest benefit or happiness to the majority of the people and as a result of the choice or action. Um, and part of this is when you see Captain Disco, he refused to take Harvey back to New York because he thinks Harvey is crazy that he isn't actually rich. And also he knows for a fact that if he goes on, he fishes and gets all of the all of the fish he can, when he goes back, he all of his crew will be able to receive their livelihood. And in that, we see Carlisle's ideal of captains of industry. Uh, captain Disco, is, he's literally a captain and he's like, Everyone respects him. He is the best of what of what he does. And he's very good. And the noble workers, we see everybody looks up to him and they rely upon him. But they're also their own people. They're constantly learning and improving by themselves, which is pretty cool. Um, I, I've had a personal connection with this story because I grew up on kind of a construction site. We, my family would find houses and we kind of fix them up. And if I wanted to spend time with my dad, I would work with him. So I associate work with a lot of good things. You see this with Harvey, with Captain Disco, and with Dan, and with his father. He learns to mature and work with other people. And because of this, he becomes very wise, and he learns how to hold his tongue and be silent and just be a good benefit to society. And I feel like that is what work does for you. And this book really emphasizes that. And to me, this book is an excellent book in which we see the growing up story of a boy who has so much potential. I would encourage you to read this book if you are a personal believer in hard work or even if you don't. This book will help you change your perspective and benefit yourself and other people.